My name is Steve Cortez. And this is the Power Dialer training session. This is a web-based service. So what does that mean exactly? That means you don't have to download any software. You can use it from any computer, Mac, or PC, any tablet. It will work on any telephone. Okay, this is not a voice over internet dialer. It is a copper line dialer, which the benefit to you is that just keeps a one-to-one -one relationship with you and the phone call. So you have a higher integrity, higher um, or less chance of you dropping a call. Okay, in fact, you should have no chance of dropping a call. Now, you are going to use this from any telephone. Preferable for you guys not to call into the dialer using Skype or Google Voice if you could stick to your cell phone or a plain ordinary telephone landline, okay? Uh, so when we set you up, I send you out an email. It looks like this. You're going to want to keep it, not just because you like us, but because you need the information on it, all right? Username and password in red right here, okay? So you'll need that to log in. So we'll save this email, all right? It's a web service. It's not software. You're not going to download anything. You're simply going to go to a website to access it. The website is right here, dialer.archtelecom.com. Okay, bookmark that. Okay? Don't try and remember it. Bookmark it. Whenever you want to launch your dialer, that's where you go. Right now, the data is managed in our website portal, which is like your agent dashboard. Same username and password to access it. Unfortunately, right now it's a different website, okay? The website archagent.com or archtelecom.com goes both go to the same place right here. So that's, that's something you'll want to bookmark too. You know, the leads are being put in three places if you're using my lead subscriptions, all right? I'm going to email them to you. I'm going to put them in the dialer, and I'm going to put them into a dashboard. And the dashboard is where you can manipulate the settings. And before we take off, I'll show that to you, okay? The dialer is where you're going to actually call them. Okay, and treat the email as convenience. If you're out on the road or somewhere, uh, the email always comes later than what's loaded into the dialer and what's loaded into the dashboard. Okay, all right, if I scroll down into this magnificent document called the welcome email, it says how to get started. And we have this user guide right here. If you click on that, this is going to pop up. This is meant to be a living document, not something for you guys to print. We, have, we probably update it every 10 days. All right. Um, just real simple, look, this is where you can get your uh, sample email and voicemail templates, all right, that we got from your coaching company. But also, like, it's difficult in a 30-minute webinar, despite how articulate of an individual I am, for you to understand everything I'm going to say. And you've never seen it before, right? So this is something that you can go back to as a reference. So you probably want to bookmark this user guide. Save that email, okay? So if you just look on the top, it'll do everything. How do you log in? So the dialer was meant to preload lists into it. But look, we're not incarcerating you into using our lead lists. If you prefer to use somebody else, we've either built syncs or you also have a manual uploader. Okay. The manual uploader is this right here. It's called a CSV, comma separated variable is the term. It's basically an Excel spreadsheet with all the functions stripped out. Okay. Um, if you look at this template right here, all I'm doing is saying if you're using Joe Bob's web service to load leads, let's say you're getting from your title company, I got to be able to read the data so I can put it in the right place card holder. So your job is to tell me where that data is. So what you do is if it's a phone that you want me to put into the phone system, you got to tell me that it's called phone, okay? You can't say, you know, pound sign and, and I won't so I, it's got to be one of these possible column headers okay if it's my data um, you know I'm going to go landline cell line secondary lien holder if it's your data it's going to be whatever you call phone one phone two phone three now if you're using a big lead provider land voice boomtown someone like that let me know that just reply to your welcome email we have mapping for that so you don't have to mess with this okay um, but of course you can map your own dialer Okay, we also sync on the back end with your contact relation, what does the CRM stand for? I forgot, Customer Relationship Manager, okay? So top producer, eEdge, Wise Agent, Infusionsoft, we just released contextually, they'll be up here. If I click on a logo, look, it's going to tell you how to walk or how to sync your top producer with your Arch Power Dialer. Okay, if you're like me, you want to hit the easy button, 
You can always just send me an email to support at ArchAgent with your credentials, meaning your ID and password, and I'll have someone here do it for you. Okay, eEdge, all you Keller Williams people that use eEdge, this product does not have um, a plug-in for me to uh, let you sync with. I have to do it for you, so you have to email me. So if you look right here, it says configuring your eEdge system for automatic lead import. It says email me, username, password, okay? So further on down here, anything else on this dialer, um, how to rename, how to push from the Arch portal, you may want to do that if you're real particular about the listings that I'm going to put in there. I mean, the Arch, the Arch leads can be automatically filtered by mileage, specific zip code, and price. But if you're super particular, you can always just select the ones you want and then manually push them. Okay, how to create your neighborhood data. That's the just listed, just sold stuff right here. I'm going to go through all of this, guys. I'm just showing you it's all on here. If you're using Red X, we have a sync. Um, and again, voicemail, email scripts. Anyway, it's all here. Okay, so let's go to the dialer and get started.